Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Get Some. I am your sommelier, Danielle Lindau with 5 to Wine Time, and today we are going to get some sparkling wine. And instead of going to the motherland of Champagne, we're actually gonna go to the Southern Hemisphere. We're gonna go to Argentina. I wanna showcase great sparkling wines can be made all around the world, and Alta Vista is a fantastic example of that. It is a sparkling 100% Malbec coming from Argentina. The Alta Vista Winery has actually history in Champagne and with their method of Champenois, but they are bringing over the Cremant method and doing sparkling wine in Argentina in stainless steel tanks and doing that second fermentation in those tanks before adding it to the bubbles creates a whole nother level of freshness. So let's get right into it. As I said, this is the Alta Vista Brut, 100% uh, Malbec. Remember when opening champagne, never aim it towards anyone or glass, as there is a lot of compression in the bottle. So always spinning the bottle. As I said, Domain um, Alta Vista actually does 100% Malbec. It's a beautiful rosé. Alta Vista does some really great practices, not only for wine making techniques, but also taking care of the land itself. They do sustainable practices at the vineyards using the grape pumice after pressing, deacetizing it, and then using it in its compost for the fertilizing for the next year's harvest. So they take love not only for the grapes that are making the wine, but the vines themselves and the land that they make this wonderful wine from. So without further ado, let's try some sparkling. On the nose, I'm getting strawberries. I am getting some really beautiful floral aromatics on it. And then there's this bu beautiful buttery brioche, almost that sourdough notes coming from the second fermentation. bubbles um this is beautiful it is a 100 malbec so you're getting those blueberries the red fruit notes to it some bright raspberries and then there's the floral component of like lilacs and lilies and a little bit of like rose notes to it there's complexity in this sparkling wine that you would see in champagne where you have the buttery brioche notes to it the baking spice notes because of the second fermentation and all the love but you're getting it in Argentina as a rosé, and I think that's beautiful. Um, really nice. I would say this is a great option for patios. In the summertime, Malbec and barbecue food just go so well together. So I hope you enjoyed this experience of trying a sparkling Malbec from Argentina. It is five to wine time, so grab yourself a glass, and I'll see you at the next episode. Cheers. And this is how you get drunk from these episodes. <laughs> that if you don't give the love to what you <laughs> I know that felt like a that's why I had to stop it I was like Domain Alta Vista does some wonderful practices at the winery to make sure that they are leaving a less of a carbon footprint in their why why am I flubbering now why am I flubbering? Entertaining. Aha! Uh -huh.